Hello everyone, today I'm going to teach you how to cook simple tuna festo if you don't have basil leaves. These are the ingredients. We have the hot dog, carrot, onion, garlic, tuna, cashew nuts, and we have the brown sugar, salt, pepper, Mayonnaise is an optional, and then we have uh, Italian spice, and of course, we have the boiled uh, noodles or pasta. Now, let's start. Kuha po tayo ng water. Pakuluan po natin. Then, wait until it's boiled. Then, uh, put the noodles or the pasta. Tain po natin siyang maluto. Lubog po natin para hindi po masunog yung uh, pasta. So, pag kumulo na, check nyo lang yung ano niya, uh, softness kung okay na. 10 to 15 minutes after. Tapos, lagay po tayo ng oil. Ang ginagamit ko this time is tuna oil. You can use olive oil. Then put the onion. Then garlic. Haluin niya lang hanggang sa maluto siya. And then uh, option to, hot dog. So nasa inyo kung gusto niyo maglagay niyan. Isa nyo lang. Tapos, carrots. And then, put the tuna. So, kahit na anong brand ng tuna, ha? Hindi ko sponsored yan. <laughs> kahit na anong brand ng tuna, pwede nyo gamitin. But, I prefer the, the plain uh, tuna. So, gisa-gisa lang. After nun, you use pepper. Then, the noodles. Put the noodles. You just struggle. Oh. <laughs> struggle pag lalagay. Okay. So, halo-haloin lang natin. Mix lang natin mabuti. Okay, pag nahalo na, Lagyan natin ng konting uh, asin. And then, uh, brown sugar para mabalance yung lasa niya. Yung alat at tamis. Okay, haluin nyo lang. Halo lang ng halo. Para mag-even yung lasa ng tuna sa noodles. And then, I use uh, Italian um, spices kasi wala akong basil leaves. Pero, mas masarap po kung may basil leaves kayo na ilalagay. Yung fresh basil leaves po ah. O kaya yung meron ng pibili sa supermarket yung ready na. Na with basil leaves. So, pwede nyo ilagay yan. So, depende sa inyo kung gaano karami yung ilalagay yung spices. This is actually good for merienda or you can para din sa breakfast. So, you can now put um, cheese. This is optional as well. Kung gusto nyo maglagay ng cheese pang palasa. So, dagdag din sa alat na lasa and creaminess of the tuna pesto. Yung nasa inyo. It's just variety. Then, you can put cashew nuts at the end. Para medyo crunchy siya. Pag kakainin nyo na. So, ganun lang. Halo-halo lang. So, para sabi ko nga sa inyo, mas masarap kung basa leaves yung ilalagay nyo. So, ito na yung ating ready tuna pesto.